Guess what, boy? You're right to go like that. We have guests tonight from Georgia. Hi. <laughs> but not Georgia, Peachtree, Atlanta, Georgia. The Republic of Georgia. <laughs> You may well go. <laughs> Check her out. I gonna sit on him? <laughs> wait, wait, what? What did you say? I gotta sit on him? No, uh... <laughs> yeah, 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 you do, yeah. No, 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 it best not. No. Oh, she likes you! Ah, all right, go in, go in. Well, yeah, you can stay if you want. Okay. Okay. Uh, when I tap you on the shoulder, please state your name and where you're from. Uh, no, no, I tapped him first. <laughs> right, and also, uh, you are? From Georgia. The Republic of Georgia? The Republic of Georgia. Which is a former Soviet satellite, uh, but now is a, a country all on its own, yes, in fact, the okay. Republic of Georgia. Yes, used to be Soviet Union. Used to be Soviet Union, and now is free to enjoy... Yes. Life. Exactly. <laughs> so. so, what are you doing in the United States? Are you on vacation? Uh, no, I moved here. From New York. Oh, from New York. Yes. <laughs> I used to, I live in New York 20 years. Have you ever been to the Republic of Georgia? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. You have been there? I born there and I was 28 when I came here. Was oh, God, don't, don't give your age away. <laughs> they'll, be, they'll, be, they'll be working it out. No, so, uh, good. Uh, what do you do for a living? Is this a listening device by... Oh, no, it's one of our microphones. All right, there you are. I'm a pianist. Really? Really? Oh, what a... Wait, hey, wait a minute. We don't know if she's any good. You're a, a, you're a, you're a piano... You're a pianist? Piano, yes. Yeah, really? Really? Do we, do we have a piano? We don't have a... We don't have a piano? <laughs> Really? <laughs> I'm so terribly sorry. Uh, we don't have a piano. Next we, time. We, hold on a second. <laughs> <laughs> if MD ever tells you this late night, I got an even playing field, you can tell them otherwise, all right? <laughs> we don't. We apparently don't even have the instruments for a band. <laughs> Oh, well, you, uh, you don't need lipstick. You look great. You look <laughs> absolutely... Anyway, good news. We're sending you to a restaurant. Apparently, we can afford that, but not a piano. Where are we... Uh... Oh, yeah. What about Mastro Steakhouse? Mastro Steakhouse. You can enjoy... Really? Yes. And did you come with a friend or a boyfriend or a My husband? My boyfriend. Your boyfriend is here? Is yeah. he American? He's from here. I'm Italian. Ita an Italian-American? Yes. Hang American-Italian. On. Hold on a second. I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> I mean, see, what we like to what we like to do here is reinforce national stereotypes in a w way of we can all better understand each other. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, good luck with the piano playing. Thank you so much. No, thank you. I go now. No, you. <laughs> you stay if you like. <laughs> they will leave if I stay here. They'll leave if I stay here. <laughs> Sponsored by Netflix. Your TV shows and movies, your way. Ladies and gentlemen, Craig Ferguson.
good. That's fine, it's more than enough. I really appreciate it. I too, I too am delighted to be in an air-conditioned building. Yeah. Yeah. That's why they're so excited. I'm Ooh. so glad to be indoors! <laughs> That's why they're here, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, the only reason exactly. they're here. It's the only reason I'm here. <laughs> I don't have skin, so why the hell am I here? I don't know. You're here because you go where I push you. <laughs> Is that a sex thing? Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. It's a great day for America, everybody. It is. It is hot here in Los Angeles, but very, very hot. And it's so hot that my lips are all cracky. Oh, you got cracky lips. I've got, little, I've got cracky lips. The wildfire watch is in effect. There's no rain. Everything's dry. It's very dry here. It's, very dry. It's drier than a stoner's mouth. <laughs> Do you want to play How Dry Is It? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. then. Uh, how dry is it? Uh, it's drier than a pool after Val Kilmer does a cannonball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Me out, Sorry, Jeff. man. Sorry, man. All right, it's drier than Dick Cheney's eyes at the end of Old Yeller. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah that ain't not bad, that's eh? That's good. That's a good yeah, one. Yeah, take like that, that Cheney. Thought you'd retire. No, you haven't. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's drier than Godzilla's scrotum. Godzilla scrotum would be that dry. God, doesn't, doesn't Godzilla come out of the ocean? Yeah, trust Whenever me. Whenever I'm in the ocean, my areas get very moist. Is that right? <laughs> trust me, he's got a dry scrotum. Well, wait a minute. I think, isn't Godzilla uh, a lady? I thought Godzilla was a woman. No, no, Godzilla's a dude. Really? I don't know, man. I look forward to hearing from you nerds. <laughs> <laughs> See, I did you. I did the, the stare there. I went nerds. <laughs> have you ever have you ever seen women do that to each other? Oh yeah, yeah. It's terrified. Oh hi. <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> there's like there's stuff going on there that I don't. I you shouldn't get no, near. No man. No, I know. <laughs> oh that. What a lovely dress. <laughs> Anyway, it's a great day for America, very dry here. Uh, not a great day for Alec Baldwin, who was arrested this morning. After Yes, I know, I am also scandalized, the person who's making it up. The, um, <laughs> no, I was arrested, he, I wasn't arrested this morning. <laughs> he, he, Alec Baldwin, was arrested this morning after getting a ticket for riding his bike the wrong way in New York City. I don't know how you ride it the wrong way, kind of like with your ass over the handlebars or something. <laughs> riding it backwards. <laughs> Have you ever ridden it backwards yet? Yeah, I have, yeah. Yeah, all right. Anyway, witnesses say that Alec Baldwin was angry, belligerent, he was yelling at passers-by, and then he got on his bike and got arrested. Yeah, right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, what I'm saying is he was, you know, he was screaming and kicking and cursing in New York City. Or as Beyonce's sister calls it, go an elevator on your ass. <laughs> <laughs> you, you see that footage? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. man. Yeah. I was like, that is a bit more than. <laughs> Do you know the director of the new Batman movie has tweeted out the first image of Ben Affleck in the new bat suit? Now, I, I think Ben Affleck is going to make a good Batman. I know a lot of people are like, no, I'm like, no, he's going to be good. But I think he needs to spend a little more time in the gym. Do we have a picture of the. Yeah, come on, man. <laughs> Really? That's the applaud? That's the oh, one. yeah. Yeah, that's what we want. We want a fat Batman, but you don't. You don't want an overweight Batman. You say you want them, just like women say they want a guy with a sense of humor, but you don't really! <laughs> just show pictures. We just like pictures. Yeah. Show pictures of overweight people wearing superhero costumes. That's what we came here for, that and the air conditioning. <laughs> Oh, also, the most popular baby names for 2013 were revealed, Noah and Sophia. Now, they're very nice, but remember, trendy names can come back and haunt your child later on. Just ask my oldest girl, Chumbawamba. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll say what you like about her. She gets knocked down, she gets back up again. <laughs> yeah. And she gets knocked down. And the yeah, yeah. You remember that? Back up. Yeah, great, great song. Great song. No, nah, it wasn't. It wasn't a great song. It was awful. It was, it was awful. Right. Yeah, I didn't care for it. Anyway, we're done.
That's it? That's it. I don't want to do it anymore. It's too hot. <laughs> it's too... I can't believe you've stoked the fire, given the fact it's so hot. Look at that fire roaring behind you. I was feeling kind of cold, actually. Feeling a little cold. Well, that would be probably because you're dead. Yeah, I'm dead. Yeah. I'm uh, more machine now than man. Yeah. So am I, really. <laughs> <laughs> Let me do that. We, yeah, we don't know what to do with that, Craig. No, Did you hear that? I was kind of, I like that noise out of an audience. We don't really know where to go with that, Craig. We feel kind of bad. Um, uh, show us a picture or something. <laughs> All right, here's Fat Batman. No, show, yeah. there's, there. Wait, there you are. Yeah. 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 Well done, everybody. We'll be right back. We'll be right back. Piano free, right, Jeff? No piano. There will no be piano. no piano, none of this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try it again. Maybe, maybe you've got. Have you got a sound effect for this? Welcome to uh, the piano bar. What's your name? Hey, how you, how you doing? My name's uh, Jim. How are you? Jim? Yeah, Jim. Jim. <laughs> just, uh, I just uh, blew in from Albuquerque. How you been? What do you mean you blew in from Albuquerque? Well, it was, the wind was very strong outside. It blew me. How you been, man? How you doing, friend? Yeah, I'm all right. We got rid of the piano, and now it's just my imagination you're hearing. <laughs> We used to have a chick played here, beautiful woman, from Georgia. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she was all right. Hooked up with a mobster and went west. Quite a sassy lady, that one. I remember her, real firecracker there. Real firecracker. Yeah, yeah. What do you mean you remember her? Have you been here before? Once or twice, once or twice. Uh, you don't remember me? It's your old friend. My old friend, Jim? Jim, your old friend. <laughs> I'm bored with us now. Yeah. All right, come on. Uh, what time is it, Jeffrey Peterson? It's tweet mail time. Time to take advice from a man who will quietly judge you with a series of feminine, passive-aggressive glances. Do it. We'll just do a jingle. Yeah, yeah, sure. All right, yeah, then. Yeah. Tweets from the Evils. Tweets from the Evils. Yeah. All right. Uh, this is from Kurt in Johannesburg, South Africa. Oh. Oh, yeah. Had it? Kurt. Have you ever been to South Africa? Yeah, yeah, sure, yeah. What yeah. did you do there? Yeah, I just uh, had some uh, some beer, got crazy. Oh, I fought a shark. I fought a shark when you I was... fought a shark? They got a lot of great white sharks down there. They do have a lot yeah, of great yeah, white sharks yeah. down there. They have a concentrate. They all uh, swim around, and then they put that little seal thing out, and then... Arr. Yeah, oh, I was, I was the seal thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Is that how you got the way you That's are? That's right, yes. I was okay. eaten by sharks, yeah. <laughs> You look nice. Uh, Craig, what are the chances you'll come to South Africa to perform? Uh, pretty good after December, I'd say. What do you think? Yeah, yeah, no, we'll totally be there. Yeah, we'll totally be there. I'm going to do that little thing behind the boat where the shark comes up and bites you. Sure, yeah. And what are you going to do? I'll, I'll be there. I'll, I'll be, I'll be there, yeah. <laughs> This is from Leela in San Mateo, California. You ever been there? San Mateo, yes, indeed. Did you hear that uh, Dracula's castle in Transylvania is up for sale and that it's owned by Queen Victoria's descendants? I'd quite like to buy Castle Dracula. I wonder how much it is. If I had Castle Dracula, I'd walk around all day like this. 
Hello. <laughs> but then when anyone came in, I'd say, Welcome to God's Aldrigula. I love the way you look. <laughs> oh, I, I love your cape, Dracula. <laughs> uh, this is from uh, Yi En in Taiwan, who says, uh, Bless you. Uh, <laughs> well, <that's... laughs> is, that, is that what she said? Is that it? <laughs> yeah. What is amazing is, really good. what's amazing is, yeah. clearly, clearly Yi En is a psychic because up until that point, I didn't know anyone was going to sneeze. I said the name, the person sneezed, and then she said, bless you. <laughs> this is unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> this is from Mark in Wheeling, West, West Virginia. You ever been there? Oh, yeah, Mark. <laughs> Dear Craig and Secretariat, why don't you guys team up and remove Jeff from his podium? What are you talking what about? What the hell, man? What are you talking about? It's the three amigos here. We're the three guys together. It's the three of us against the rest of the world, including CBS. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. That's right. All right. Welcome to the Three Amigos, where we're, tonight we're going to talk about, uh, what are we going to talk about? Passive-aggressive looks to imply that you are not really meaning what you say you're meaning. Lazen, I love your dress. I don't really. You got one? Yeah, uh, Secretariat, that's, uh, that's a great little uh, scarf thing you're wearing. <laughs> and finally, Secretariat. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care what you think. That is quality entertainment. Yeah. All right, get out of there. Get out. Yeah. Um, this is uh, from Katie in New York, New York, who says, uh, "Craig, my college has this thing where we ask seniors what they'd rather give up: cheese or oral sex. I'm curious, what would you choose?" <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> Can't That's you... utterly ridiculous. I'm American now. I don't care about cheese. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Or what I would say is, I'd give up cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Can't you combine both? I don't know. Isn't that a thing? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if you girls have stopped flirting, I'll get on with this, will you? All right, and finally, this is from Fod in... Fod, that's a nice name, isn't it? Fod, yeah. Fod. Fod. Is that... What kind of name is that? Fod. 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 This is from Fod in Portland, Oregon, who says, Craig, do you think Serge from the cheesesteak shop has a chance to take over the Late Late Show in <laughs> December? Oh, yeah, Serge, the guy with the weird accent. He's a great guy. Oh, yeah, I wish he'd phone. <laughs> Hello, who is Hi, this? Hi, Craig, it's Serge. How are oh, you? Hey, Serge, how are you? Hey, uh, your tie looks great. Hold on, I'm looking at you right now. <laughs> I was giving you a weird look there. Uh, but you can't tell on the phone. Yeah. <laughs> That's the whole thing about a visual joke there, Serge. Do you really have to be visible for it to work? Your hair looks spectacular. <laughs> How are you? What's going on? Uh, I'm good. What the, are you giving me the lick? No, no. You're right. It's right. If you guys... What the hell was that? <laughs> I'm just happy somebody else heard it as well. <laughs> Ro Ronnie, Rod. Are we, so wait a minute, we don't just don't, don't have a piano, we're also picking up the local taxi cab company. <laughs> what is that? The hell, man. Can we at least have a, a frequency that, what is going on? I thought this was CBS. Are you trying to tell me that CBS Corporation can't get a signal that doesn't include people? <laughs> On CB radios? <laughs> I hope someone can explain this to me. Oh, yeah, hello? 
Uh, ten four, good buddy. Ronnie is uh, no, around over here. Uh, how are you doing? Just good. Signals for us. All right. Well, I only hope the person who's lucky enough to take over this show in the new year gets the same level of professionalism <laughs> <laughs> that I've always enjoyed. <laughs> we'll be right back after the important thing. Mike and Molly, the season finale is May the 19th, right here on the CBS Network. He's in Nashville doing stand-up tomorrow and Thursday night. Take a look at this. <laughs> Billy Gardell, everybody! I'm doing good. No, you look great. I lost man. a little more weight. Yeah, you have yeah. lost a little more. It's I'll, kind of uh, it's never falling off. For you. another season, I'm trying to stay. Yeah, alive. congratulations. You, that's another. That's like uh, season twelve. Done? Season. Oh God, willing, I'd do it till they evicted me. No, uh, I. Uh, we're on season five. We're season five. That's the money one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Five years? Really? Now, you, you've been doing it four years, you're going to start the fifth year, right? Yeah, yeah, we're going into the fifth year. And you know, season five on a sitcom, that's like catching a unicorn, so I'm very grateful. <laughs> Did you know the unicorn is the national animal of Scotland? No, but I believe you. It's true. <laughs> it is absolutely true. It, it's a pretend animal, and it's the national animal of Scotland. I'm going to hear from people now, though, who say it's not a pretend animal. A lot of Guinness over there. A lot, a lot of Guinness, Guinness. Yeah, lot of Guinness. yeah. Guinness in Ireland, though, yeah, really. You know what more. we should have? What? A unicorn. We should have a unicorn. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Your days are numbered. <laughs> That's it. Young people want a horse with a horn on his head. <laughs> you... Oh, it's not a real horse. Knock it off. <laughs> Hey, so you're still doing stand-up, though, so you're not really sure that this sitcom thing's going to work out, still doing the stand-up. Well, I still have that panic, yeah, that it yeah, could yeah. go away at any minute. Where so. are you playing in Nashville, Zanies? I'm in Nashville at Zanies this week for the, the uh, Vince Vaughn Wild West Comedy Tour, and then we're doing a benefit for a friend of mine who passed away, uh, me, Ron White, Kathleen Madigan. We're going to get together and do a, a benefit oh. for his kids for their college fund. If you're in Nashville, join us there. At Zanies? At, uh, no, no, we're doing, that's, uh, it's a theater. Oh, I should, well, I should probably know the James K. Pope Theater, that'll be it. Probably know. I did a special well, in Nashville on once. Yeah, so there. you did. Yeah. I did, yeah. I, I, I gave a special. I was working in a massage parlor. Yeah. And, uh... <laughs> <laughs> no, I... No, I did. I love Nashville. It's a great town. You know that yeah. town? Oh, yeah, absolutely. You ever There's... go down Broadway thinking oh. about what it'd be like if maybe you were a country singer? No. But I, the thing about those southern towns is it's all the same. There's, there's a bar every four feet with a church in between them. <laughs> so the system down there is I'm drunk, I'm sorry, I'm drunk, I'm sorry. That's like, uh, all right, that's like... Uh, he doesn't like anybody being funnier than him. No, 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 no. No, it's not that. It's the clapping. Sorry. It's the clapping against me. It makes me feel weird. I'm like, knock it off. I don't, I don't mind the laugh, and the laughing's fine, but the clapping feels like the, the hand version much. of this. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> See what I mean? You know what yeah, I mean? It's, it's a like, ah, oh, yeah, I know, I don't know. Do you know, have you ever seen that? You're what? married, right? Have you yes. ever seen this? When your wife talks to a woman that she, she's not really keen on, but she, for oh, social yeah. reasons, has to pretend yeah. she is. She goes, oh, hi, it's great to see you. Yeah. And does that thing? The eyes. The eyes go yeah, down. Yeah, it's like. Where you get these eyes, you get these, she goes, huh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's scary. Yeah. 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 You're not kidding. Uh, 
Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, still doing stand-up, though. That's good. I like that. I, I am. Think I like to get out there. I love it still. I, I love doing stand-up. You do crowd work. You ever just go out with, like, no material? And no, just, like... I've never been a guy that was quick enough to do that. Like, really? you're a guy that's quick enough to do I'm not. I write it all out, and then if you heckle me, I say vicious, ugly things to you. <laughs> I, I think that's what stand-up's all about. The well, opportunity I... to say vicious, ugly things to... <laughs> oh, yeah. Stand-up's about entertaining people more than... Yeah, that's right. I did a movie. I did my first movie. Stop it. What? Yeah. What did you do? I, I did a little movie. It's, uh, we, it was a low-budget movie. I was, uh, it's me and a German shepherd, and we're solving a crime. Whoa. <laughs> this might be a joke, I'm thinking. Is no, this a joke? No. 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 My kid's in private school. No. Okay. All right. I no. I, uh, no, I did. I did a little movie. It's going to come out in What's it uh, called? February. It's called Dancer and a Dame, and, uh, or as my dad calls it, Billy and Hooch. <laughs> And then, well, you saw you solve a crime. We solve a crime. You and a dog. You and a dog. A I'm German talking, Shepherd. I talk to the dog every day. Like you talk to Jeff. I talk Jeff's to the dog. A, Jeff's not a dog. <laughs> the dog you know. was very good. Jeff's very good, but he's not a dog. Is it that dog that was in that movie, uh, Babe? Remember that dog? No, I don't think the dog had done anything before. That. All right, so it's a, so the dog's a first timer. Yes, yes. Yeah. But I figure it worked for Tom Hanks, so I'll give it a shot. Yeah, yeah. You know the dog. You remember that movie, Babe, where yeah, the, the pig. and the the pigs in it, and the the sheep dog gives a really good performance. Yeah. That was the movie when I saw that. I went, I don't want to be an actor anymore because uh, like the dog was really good, and I'm like, <laughs> I'm like. I aspire to be as good as a dog. Yeah. Uh, me too. Me too. You know, I, I gotta get into something else. Me too. But that dog was good. <laughs> yeah. My dog was good. It was good. Yeah. Kuja was the dog's name. Yeah. <laughs> Not Kujo, Kuja. I don't know what Kujo is. It didn't matter, it scared me too. Yeah. <laughs> what is Kujo? Yeah. It was uh, Kujo's the Stephen King where the big dog. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Kuja is what you want, Kujo. man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You don't want cooch. You, did you have a dog? I don't have a dog. Well, what's wrong with you? You, I'm hate, you hate dogs? I'm allergic. You're allergic to dogs? You did a movie with a dog? What, what the hell is wrong with you? Well, I told you, my kid's in private. Well, school. I got that. <laughs> I was eating Zyrtec like Pez. I'm like, hey, no, yeah. no, I'm fine. I'm fine. So you got that. Really? You're allergic to dogs? Yeah. You did a movie with a dog? Yeah. Couldn't they get you a puppet dog for your scenes with a dog? <laughs> That's uh, also... That's the sequel. I tell you, you must be the worst detective in the world because that's... He's not a dog and he's not a dog. And that's twice you've mistaken. Uh, well, that's... See, that's why I needed the dog to help ah. you solve the crime. And the dog's a German Shepherd? The dog's now, a I've dog. got a German Shepherd. You do have uh, it. That's a fine dog. Fine dog. Yeah, it's a great dog. It's a, I got a German Shepherd, a Jack Russell, and a French Bulldog. And the German Shepherd... Who runs I, the house? Out the of German Shepherd. Uh, really? Yeah, the Jack Russell, the Irish dog's drunk, and the, the French dog... <laughs> French dog just rolls right over. Uh, it's true. It's fantastic. Yeah, it's the way it is. <laughs> the German Shepherd's like, everyone, you go over here. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> woof, woof. I said to someone with coming. Chase. <laughs> I'm so, well, what about a cat? You got a cat then? Nothing. I got a fish. <laughs> I got a fish. What kind of fish? Uh, it's one, fish? No, it's one of those fish. My wife says it <laughs> reminds her of me because it's one of those fish that, like, I know you want to do a blowfish joke. <laughs> no. It crossed no. my mind. It crossed my mind. No, it's one of those fish that doesn't play well with the other fish. Like, you got to keep it isolated or it goes nuts. That's a shark, man. No. no. no it's, just... it's a little shark. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. They make little, how do you, they get big, you know. They do, yeah. Well, we've kept him alive longer than he should have been. He should have been gone for a while, so. My wife, she keeps things alive. She kept me alive. Yeah, well, well, we're out of time. All right. Yep. <laughs> you. Yeah. I suppose I should have asked you about the awkward pause, but it felt like we just slipped right I think into it's it a naturally. Natural thing. Yeah. Before I go, I gotta say something though. Oh, okay. You're the first guy that put me on late night television ever when this stuff all started. I want you to know that I'm grateful. You're fantastic. I love you. I don't know where you're going or what you're gonna do, but you're fantastic and thank you. Thank you. Uh, yeah.
is a world-renowned magician. His musical short, The Magician, is uh, now available online. Please welcome James Galea, everybody. James Galea. <laughs> James, I'm very excited that you're here. I thought we were going to do a trick then and put it back together. Watch this, impressive. right? Keep, watch yep. this. Are you ready? Yep. Right? Here it is. I'm the smallest little pieces. <laughs> it's a very good trick. It's not really a trick. It's, it's a terrible a, trick. It's a trick. I was, uh, what do you call it when you uh, distract people? Oh, misdirection. Misdirection. I'll be doing some of that a little bit later on. Fine. Are you? Are you yeah. going to do, do a trick, right? I am going to do a I trick. I see your sleeves are rolled up. Yeah, I roll them up so that people don't think things are up there. <laughs> well, I don't know how it's going to be done if you're going yeah. to cheat by rolling up your sleeve. We're going to have a little bit of fun. I'm, oh, careful. Um, I'm going to show you. Did you do that? Yeah, I, was, I like your right, watch, right. so I just needed to get in there a little bit easier. All right. Um, do you like card tricks? Do you like little playing cards? Do you play cards at all? Yeah, yeah, a little bit, you know. What do you play? Uh, you know, strip poker. Fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, first thing I want you to see is that all the cards are different, okay? No two cards are alike uh, in the deck. In just a second. Are you happy with that? Yes, yes, yeah, I can see that. Yeah, yeah, there's, it's a normal, yep. yeah, it's a deck of cards. <laughs> right. It's a normal pack of cards. You can buy them in any magic shop. Um, it's going to be simple. Thanks. In just a second, I'm going to get you to take out a card. I don't want to let me see what it is. So I'm going to face the other direction. I won't look at all. Then I want okay. you to sign your name uh, nice and big through the middle of the card. It'll make sure there's only one like yours. Right. I'll turn around so I don't see. Uh, just take any card. Keep it face down. I'll, I'll look around in just a second. And I won't look at any monitors. Sign your name on, so turn it over, sign your name on the face All of the right, card. All right, I'll do that then. Yeah, nice and big, and show the camera so that everyone's going to be able to see, and at home everyone will be able to see what it is. Uh, all right, I'm just drawing a little. Okay. All right. <laughs> And show the camera nice and still. And once you've all seen it in the audience, just give me a big yes so that I know that you have. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, uh, uh. Hey. Hey. We're all good. Is it safe to look back, Greg? What? Is it safe to look back? Yeah, yeah. You it's face down? All right, yeah, it's face okay, down, yeah. You remember, yeah. right? Just place it on top of me. Don't yeah, lose yeah, it. Yeah, all right. You remember your card, right? Yeah, yeah, I think so, yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> well, you remember what you wrote on it. So yes, yes, I do, yeah. All right, we're going to find your card in a special. Hold that your left hand nice and flat. All right, okay. <laughs> Yeah. If I flick the cards, your card should come on top of the deck. Uh, your card was the uh, the. Eight. Did you not put your name on on the card? No, I did put my name on the card. Did you really? Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna stuff that up. What was your card? Sorry. Uh, it was the four of spades. Not four. Uh, have another look in your hand. All right. Holy crap. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wow. Thanks. Um. Oh. 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 oh yeah. I like Bruce Lee. I like <laughs> wow. For a second, you're like, he is not a very good magician. I was uh, like, uh, this, the, he's going to fit right in here. And then I was like, oh, no, he's actually very good. Okay, uh, uh, just put it over here for a second. We're going to lose it in the deck. I'm going right. to show you, magicians never do the same trick twice. I'm going right. to show you how this works. Uh, do you know where the card is at the moment? Uh, yeah, it's in there somewhere. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Some people think it's on top. Some people uh, think it's on the bottom. It's about 35th from the top. I know that because I put it there. If I, if I flick it, it gets a 26. If I do it there, it gets a 22. If I did the last one, it should bring your card, uh, the four of spades, oh, back up on top. Oh, wow. That's... That, thanks. Um, thanks. Craig, if I place it in the middle, just push it in for me. Yeah, go ahead. Actually, you've got to use your thumb, not your finger, otherwise it'll come back up on top. I'll do it again just in case you missed it. Um, <laughs> watch. Have you, no you noticed that magicians wear long sleeves? You saw that before. Yeah, yeah, that's I'll right. do the same trick that most magicians need long sleeves for without the sleeves. Are you ready? Right. Oh, okay. just ready. One, two, three. That's when it changes into the ace. Yep. I don't know if I told you at the start, but I always keep a spare card inside my pocket just in case the tricks don't work. What I can't understand, though, is um, how your name gets on that one as well. Craig? <laughs> yeah. I'll, <laughs> I'll do this. I'll do it again. Just pull out a card for me. Don't let me see what it is. Any card you like, but don't let me see it. Uh -huh. If I see it, the trick's not going to work, okay? All right. Yeah, yeah I'll, I won't look. I'll look. All right, right. Don't look. Yeah, then. go right ahead. All right, then. Don't, let me, don't pick the same one. It's oh, to man. Okay. Okay. Look at that. <laughs> right. I'll tell you what. Um, they, <laughs> I'm going to show you how the trick works. I actually, have you heard of palming before? What palming is? No, I, yeah, I've done a bit of it. Oh, I see what you mean. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> Palming's when you hold the card. That's how I make it up inside the pocket. Oh, I palm right. it, then I pretend to go inside, and they go, oh, isn't that amazing? Oh, I found your card. Oh, I yep. got it. Right. I'll do it invisibly if you want to see it. That only looks good to you, to no one else. All right? Oh, right, right. If I want to do it like this, it'll look great. Watch. You see how you still can't see it? Right, right. Even but from it'll here. Be in there, right? Yeah, well, it's invisible. Oh! Unless I make it end up on top of that's not it. I know you thought it was. Right, right, Remember right. I said I keep a spare one inside my pocket? Yes. That's where you have to watch, Craig, because that's where the uh, the four of spades ends up, yeah? Hi! Okay. This is witchcraft, I say! <laughs> I'm with, thanks. Um, 
I'm going to try one little thing. Um, I tell you what, I'm going to do a trick with you. We're going to see if this works, okay? All right. Um, I'm going to make you the magician and see if this works. Now, I don't know if that's a great idea. Okay. To be <laughs> It'll be cool. Uh, you notice the window behind you. The one yes, in the, the great city of Reno, Nevada. Yes, it's yeah. wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> what we're going to do is a famous magic trick where you, as the magician, will make the card appear stuck on the window. So all what right. I'm going to get you to do, right. um, I'll fan them out for you. You're right. going to hold them like this. Right. And then I'm going to get you to throw them at the window. One card will stick there. It'll be your card. The crowd will go wild. It'll be awesome. Are you ready for this, Craig? Yeah, I, I don't know if you want to do this. It's, a, <laughs> it's okay. Watch close. We're on the count of three. Ready? Right, one. Just, just throw, just it's to the middle, the middle window. Uh, th yep. This one here? That one there. Ready? One, two, three. That is, uh, that is a terrible, terrible trick. Thanks, that was Jeff. Awful. <laughs> that was awful. Um, awkward pause? Yeah. yeah uh, um, that was a terrible trick, but we're going to make it the best trick you've ever seen, Craig. Okay. Secretary, would you come on out? Yeah. You're going to notice something, Craig. You're stuck on the butt of Secretary. There's a little gift for you, Craig. You're kidding me, man. If you've done this... What does this, it say on there, Craig? It says, for Craig. Yeah, and it's completely sealed, right? You can see that? Yeah, yeah, I, it's sealed with a... Thank you, my of, assistant. It, yeah, thanks very much. That's weird, man. Thank you very much for helping out. <laughs> Thank you very much for having me. I appreciate Is that it. it? Yeah. That's crazy. Thank you very, very, very much. I'm like, what? <laughs> uh, my apologies to Lennon Parham. We'll have her back uh, soon. Uh, and I'll probably be wearing this outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Remember the lady, uh, the concert pianist from Georgia who was here and we said, hey, come back at the end. We'll find a piano and you can play at the end. And she said, no. <laughs> But we do have a piano behind here.